Gap or guaranteed asset protection is a protection that protects the consumer in the event of a total loss occurring because when a consumer finances a loan, obviously they owe a specific amount. And if that total loss were to occur and they were to actually owe more than what the vehicle values for, the Gap is going to step in and pay the difference up to 150% of market value. They're also going to pay that customer's deductible of up to $1,000 in addition to that benefit. Gap is worth every penny, and for just a few dollars extra a month on your payment, it can protect you for up to 84 months of financing the vehicle itself. Um, when, you, when you purchase a vehicle, a vehicle is going to depreciate at an average of about 11% a year. And with uh, terms being longer than ever on vehicles, uh, customers are paying down their loans a little bit slower pace than what they would be if they were at 48 months or less. So that creates obviously a gap in the event of them owing more money than what the vehicle values for. And the gap is going to step in and pay up to that 150% of market value and that deductible of up to $1,000 in addition to that. Gap is going to pay the difference up to 150% of market value versus what the consumer owes on their auto loan versus what the insurance company's settlement is for that total loss. In addition to that, they're going to pay the customer's deductible of up to $1,000 in even of that total loss. And a total loss can be one of many things. It can be an accident, it can be flood, fire, theft, hail, the list goes on and on. And this is going to protect that customer for the event of any of those total losses. Gap is so important for uh, purchasing a, a wheelchair accessible vehicle when financing simply because this is one of the biggest investments that customer is going to make in their lifetime. And uh, we want to make sure that they're going to have everything protected and not have to worry about owing more on a vehicle than what the insurance company is willing to give them at time of total loss.